Well, it seemed like everyone else was posting today, so you know what? It's the end of the month, might as well post as well. Welcome back to Dollar or Less Food, and yes what? We're doing a product that I've never had before. We are trying some Stauffer's Ginger Snaps. I'm calling it Stauffer's, because I'm pretty sure it's how you pronounce it, because it's spelled S-T-A-U-F-F-E-R-S. These were $1 from Dollar Tree, and we're going to see how they taste, and they are ginger snaps from a biscuit company. I mean, you know I love the biscuits, so we're going to see if these biscuits, York, Pennsylvania, so they should be American, so none of them British biscuits, not that I have anything against the British, as we know, my foreign audience, I appreciate you guys very much too, but uh, I like good old home style biscuits, and this is what these things look like. We're going to see how they taste a root. Already off to a great start. <clears throat> Put that on a paper towel down there. Keep it safe. Another bite. Hmm. Now. Typically, I'm not a person that gets ginger snaps. Typically, the only time I ever have ginger snaps is around Christmas time if I see my mother. Because she likes to get the gingerbread cookies and stuff, so. I'll sometimes have them there, but just in general, I don't do ginger snaps or ginger cookies. Not that I dislike ginger or anything, but, I mean, when I, well, although, honestly, when I do go to a, like a, a restaurant that serves sushi... And they give you the wasabi and the ginger. I don't use the ginger. I just use the straight wasabi. None of that soy sauce either. You don't need soy. It's like so much sodium. And oh, I'm getting no sodium. But why am I doing it? I'm just going to drink brown water. Mm. One thing I will say about these. Mm. Yep. There's a reason for that. Now I'm going to say, these are very heavy. The ginger flavor isn't overbearing, overbearing. It's a little bit stronger than I wanted it to be. But even though you can't really see it, the amount of molasses in this just makes it too sweet. It's a good interior view, but the ginger's a little too much. Good hint of cinnamon, though. I will say there's a nice hint of cinnamon. Yep, made in the USA. Wanted to confirm that. But the ginger, it's good. Just a little bit, maybe too much. But there's too much molasses making it too sweet. And that's just a let down because it gets your stomach a little full. The ginger gets you a little thirsty. Remember, ginseng is better than ginger. I'm just saying. I may be crazy, but you know what? I'm all about the ginseng, and you all know that. You all know that. I'm all about the ginseng. Mm. I just hate when stuff gets stuck in your teeth. That's what happened right here. So we got to give it a rating. What are we going to do? I've had this product sitting around for like four weeks now. I wanted to do a review on it. And I was like, nah, this, this isn't that good. Nah, it's not good. Dead to other video. Wanted to come back. I had a thing I've been planning on doing for a while. And I just... I, I've been trying to not use microwaves as much recently. And like, make sure to cook all my food. And I have a frozen meal that I want to do. But, it's like, I have all this fresh chicken and beef, and like the last thing I want to do is just, like, microwave something, just do a video of it. It's like, I'd rather just cook my own food, you know what I'm saying? That's why these things have been sitting there for weeks. Can't even see the Best Buy data anymore, because it it's just been sitting away. But, we're doing it. We're just gonna, we're just gonna pop it up. Pop, pop, a good old three. It's three out of ten. I'm not gonna, you, you see why. I've rambled a lot. I've wasted all your times. And I know everyone else has probably left the video by now. But you know what? This has been dollar or less food. And you know what? 
Trevor Wallace videos are funny. I don't care what anyone else says. He is funny. It's been dollar or less food, and I'll see you next time.